profiles. Kenneth D. Lewis, Taking America's Leading Bank to a New Level by Susie Verdes. Kenneth D. Lewis could not imagine 37 years ago when he joined North Carolina National Bank that he would be the leader of one of the world's largest financial institutions, the Bank of America. A natural of Meridian, Mississippi, Lewis was born April 9, 1947. He earned a bachelor's degree in finance from Georgia State University and is a graduate of the executive program at Stanford University. Today, Kenneth D. Lewis, the main driving force behind the company's success, is chairman, chief executive officer, and president of Bank of America Corporation. Under Lewis's leadership, with the support of Vincent A. Priya Jr., senior vice president of commercial real estate banking in South Florida, and Maria Alonso, marketing development manager of Dade County, the organization has improved customer satisfaction by 29% and shareholders have enjoyed annual total returns that consistently outpaced its peers. Just recently, after announcing Bank of America's second quarter earnings of $5.5 billion and surpassing Citigroup's profit number, Kenneth delivered a message that was received by employees with joy. Bank of America now is the most profitable financial institution in the world. Lewis was appointed Chief Executive Officer in 2001. He joined North Carolina National Bank, NCNB, as a credit analyst in Charlotte and served as Corporate Banking Officer and Western Area Director in the U.S. Department before being named Manager of NCNB's International Banking Corporation in New York in 1977. Lewis was named Middle Market Group Executive in 1983 when the group was created and was responsible for expanding and improving service to middle market companies throughout the Southeast. He led the bank's operations in Florida and Texas in the 1980s, served as President of Consumer and Commercial Banking and Chief Operating Officer in the 1990s, and was named Chairman, Chief Executive Officer, and President of Bank America in April of 2001. Lewis's highly regarded professional career has made Bank of America live up to his name, making most of its earnings at home. Its branch network covers most of the heavily populated states, and it has a vast banking business serving individuals and small firms, and a big share of the loan syndication market. By providing higher standards in consumer real estate lending, Bank of America generates revenues with an extensive line of mortgage products and services to customers nationwide. The mortgage product offerings include fixed and adjustable rate loans, first and second lien loans, and lot and construction loans for both home purchase and refinancing needs. Under Lewis's tenure, Bank of America has been widely recognized as a leader in serving the multicultural market. Among other recognitions, the institution has been repeatedly named by Fortune magazine as one of the 50 best companies for minorities and included in Hispanic magazine's Corporate 100 list for providing opportunities for Hispanics and contributing to the advancement of the Hispanic community. With a strong Hispanic customer base, currently doing business with almost half of the Hispanic households in the United States, Bank of America is better positioned than any other bank to reach and profitably serve multicultural customers. Bank of America's strategy has been to listen to the customers and always provide what they need, building value propositions for Hispanics, including the execution of key marketing initiatives in Spanish, building new stores to serve Hispanic neighborhoods, developing in-language sales tools and fulfillment materials across product lines, and mass advertising in various Spanish media outlets. Mr. Lewis believes results are important, and how the institution achieves those results is equally important. Bank of America's commitment to this principle is the key to sustaining the public trust and confidence in the company. Lewis is a member of the Financial Services Roundtable, a member of the board and the executive committee and past chairman of United Way of Central Carolinas Incorporated, a member of the committee to encourage corporate philanthropy, a director of the Home Ownership Education and Counseling Institute, vice chairman of the corporate fund board of the John F. Kennedy Center for the Performing Arts, and past chairman of the National Urban League. <laughs>